Okay, hello, and thank you for stopping in today. Uh, first of all, we're going to keep this short and sweet, so if you just need to download it, it is below in the description, and the password's down there too. Uh, and then be on your business. This is Polaris BIOS Editor 1.6.7, the version everybody's been looking for and no one can find, so I figured I'd throw together a uh, little something here for you guys. Now, uh, if you need to download this, link in the description. You're going to want to come on here up to the top, github.com forward slash xjiggitsx. I'm the AMD BIOS Flash. Go ahead and download this bad boy. It's going to get you to a directory here, which includes the real directory that you want. Okay, now this one, go ahead and bring that out to the desktop here. Now, this is going to prompt you for a password. There you go, easy peasy. Okay, now that we got that under control, we're gonna go ahead and uh, find our file folder. There we go. Now inside of here, we have our three programs. We have Polaris BIOS Editor, the ATI Patcher, and ATI Flash, okay? Instructions are also in the readme, but I'm gonna go through a little bit more detailed uh, example here. Now the first thing we're going to do is open up ATI Flash. I uh, want to go ahead and open that as administrator. Okay. Uh, now today we are going to be flashing our 560. Uh, the R9200, a lot of this series, um, and mistake, correct me if I'm wrong, uh, but I was unable to use this method to flash this uh, card. And that may be true with other AMD cards, but for a uh, general consensus, a lot of them are going to work. So what you're going to want to do here is uh, go ahead and select the graphics card that you want to flash. We're going to save this uh, BIOS file. So we're going to head onto the desktop here. It's good to stay organized, so let's make a new folder. We're just going to call this uh, BIOS Flash. Uh, RX 560. Okay, good plan. Going to get in here and we're going to call this uh, 560 stock. Uh, mine is not stock at the time, but you know, because I've already done this, but that's okay. Doesn't change anything. Very important that you uh, go ahead and make the extension .rom. If you miss this, you're not going to be able to load it into the flasher. Okay, so there you go. All right, we can go ahead. It's going to say ROM image safe to file. Okay, continue. That's awesome. Exactly what I wanted. Now we're going to go and uh, go into Polaris BIOS editor. Okay, here we're going to go ahead and we are going to navigate to the folder that we were just in. And we're going to grab that ROM. Okay, we're going to open this up. Now right now, if you get an error saying it's an invalid size of file, whether it's too large or too small or anything else, I would not recommend you proceed past this point uh, because I cannot guarantee that everything's going to work correctly after. So, with that in mind, uh, this being the 1.6.4 version, uh, this does have the one click timing patch, so you'll want to go ahead and uh, hit that. Okay? And it's going to go ahead and make the necessary adjustments to your timings and your settings. Alright, then we're going to come back up here to save as. And we're now going to call this 560 modded. Okay. Now you'll notice here it's automatically filling in the dot ROM. All right. So we're going to go ahead and save that. Okay. We're now done in the BIOS editor. We're going to come back out. We're going to go back into the flashing program. Open this up. Run as administrator. Okay, and now we're going to basically be doing the same thing, but in reverse. Make sure you select the correct card. It's our 560, not our R9200. We're going to load this image up that we just saved. Okay, 560 modded. Open that bad boy up. Okay, at this point now we're going to hit program. This is going to go ahead and flash it. All right, for me it's telling me this version of BIOS is already installed. Okay, because it's already installed. For you, it's not going to be the same. It's going to tell you that it's updated. It's also going to prompt you at this time to restart your computer. You're going to want to hit no, we're not finished yet. Okay? Now we're going to back out of here. 
done with the flasher. Okay, now we're going to go into the patcher. This is very important. This is going to uh, patch the driving or the drivers on your AMD card uh, so that it's going to be compatible. Here we're going to want to run this as administrator as well. Okay, me it's telling me it's already patched, right? So, because I've already done this. But you're going to want to go ahead and patch this through. It's just going to give you this one, uh, this one prompt. And it's going to say, do you want to patch? Yes, you're going to go ahead and patch. Bang, and you're done. At this point, now you restart your computer, and you are all set. Okay? So, thank you very much for taking your time and coming to check out the video. If you liked it, go ahead and drop a like, subscribe, comment, whatever you're feeling. If you're feeling generous, uh, you know, maybe buy me a beer. So, uh, happy mining, and I hope that this gets you all the hashes. Thanks. Peace.